Let's take a look at division for positive integers. Here's the algorithm for division for positive integers from your notes. It takes as input two natural numbers a and b and outputs two integers q and r that satisfy these properties. So I'm going to put my scratch work down here and we'll go through a concrete example. So first we need our input. Suppose I want to try this algorithm for a equals 24 and b equals 7. So step 1, I'm looking, is a less than b? So is 24 less than 7? The answer is no, and so I move on. I let q equal 0, and I let r equal the value for a. So r is 24. And now I enter the repeat loop. I'm going to let r equal r minus b. And so I look at the values there that I have, 24 minus 7, and I get 17. And that's the new value for r. And now q is going to be q plus 1. So 0 plus 1 is 1, and that's my new value for q. And now I need to check, is r less than b? So is 17 less than 7? No. So I move back up to the top of the repeat. I'm going to let r equal r minus b. So 17 minus 7 is 10, and that's my new value for r. I'm going to let q be q plus 1. So 1 plus 1 is 2, and so 2 is the new value for q. I check, is r less than b? Is 10 less than 7? No. So I move back up to the top. I compute 10 minus 7, so that's r minus b, and I get 3. That's my new value for r. I compute q plus 1, so that's 2 plus 1 is 3, and that's my new value for q. I check, is r less than b? So is 3 less than 7? Here the answer is yes, and so I can move down to the next step, which is the return statement. I'm going to return the current values of q and r. So q is 3 and r is 3 and the algorithm is done. If you have time, you should always check your work. So the r and the q that are returned are supposed to satisfy these two conditions. So 0 is less than or equal to r is less than b. So you check. Is 0 less than or equal to 3, which is strictly less than 7? Yes. And this other condition is a equal to b times q plus r. So is 24 equal to 7 times 3 plus 3? Well, 21 plus 3 is 24, and so we get yes there as well. And so we've checked our work, and the answer is q equals 3 and r equals 3.